Yeah, we're going to my YouTube channel. My name is Chukun Osuta as a phone icon. We shall be discussing how to choose a project topic part two. That means I'll discuss part one, ad initial or affirmation or before. So here we shall be discussing how to choose a project topic part two. How do you choose a project topic? Or what is project topic? Uh, uh, let's start from if you so if it is when someone it is when someone is about to graduate that you, you write a, 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 a project or you can even this this topic covers if someone who wants to choose a, 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 a Lego article or a Lego a Lego article or any article or any research work this work covers how to do research work how to choose your research topic so. How do we do it? For instance, what how to choose a pre, a pre topic or research work is whenever you want a back on any research work. Research work is something that's happening in our society. Like as I discussed, I was talking about rape. If you want to if you want if you want to discuss about rape in a write up, you can say legal assessment of rape in Delta State. Legal assessment of rape in Onicha Delta State. Legal assessment of rape in Neni and Notary Government, Anambra State. We are talking about how to rephrase, paraphrase, how to name your project or research topic. Yeah, it is from that particular topic or that thing that you want to write on. You know, pick it. let me just assume that you want to write about rape. Then, from that rape, you now choose... You know, you know, you need to write it to, so that it will be as it will, as, it will be it will be as if say you are embarking on a research topic, which is legal assessment of rape in Neni in Ubudu, Neni Anambra State, Nigeria. So, what are we talking about? We are not talking about the area of study. That's what is called area of study. What does area of study does? Area of study not where you are narrowing your study. Or case study. That's what he's talking about. As for instance, that you cannot just come and say, like, that is the reason why some lecturers or some, some researchers or scholars will always object or reject a uh, topic when you say uh, uh, rape in Nigeria. That's no, 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 no. That is too broad. You need to, you need, you need to narrow it down to your hometown. What they are saying that it cannot cover the whole Nigeria because once you say you're doing a research work, you are expected to cover everywhere. That is what research work is all about. You are not just say your 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 that you embarking on a research work. They just come and cover one or two places. No, I just come and say you are covering Nigeria. Then at the end, you just covered only Enugu State, or just covered only uh, Anambra State, or just covered only Lagos State. No, you cover thirty six states and capital. So that is the reason why it is always advisable as a scholar and as a researcher for you to narrow it down to a specific place. For instance, if it is in Lagos, you now say, you now say, uh, legal assessment of rape in Mushin local government or in Fadei Mushin local government or in Ireland to narrow it within that specific, within that particular place so that it, your, your research can be a thorough research work, not just, not, not just doing how work and how and how and break. No, 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 no. But for you to do a thorough research work that is how to choose a project or research topic we are talking about so this is the second phase of it or second or part two of the choosing a research work or project work take note please after listening to this if you have any issue or any of my discussion please feel free to contact me please Thank you for stopping by. I still mention you know, such as a phone icon. Please subscribe, like, comment, and press the link and um, press that uh, ringing bell. God bless you.